back to episode two of the all new, all big, all better. That's right, we're back, baby. Or not. <laughs> Starring I, Ken Nabisky, and Chris Fedek. Who Wait. is? You're going to make me say it. Say it? Uh, the smartest guy you'll never see on Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I got you to say it the first time. I no, no, it. you didn't. I never got to say it. You finally tricked me. I said. felt the hesitation in your voice while you were saying <laughs> this. Uh, yeah. You know, I don't like to. You're going to make a Twitter smart. account after today, right? <laughs> just, just to prove me wrong, be like, there, bitch. Oh, no, I'm not making a Twitter account. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> it's funny because recently I met somebody who was saying, um, oh, they were asking for someone's Facebook information. It's like yeah. someone younger. Yeah. And the person said, well, Facebook's for old people. So apparently, by not joining Facebook, I became young. unpopular, and now that I've waited it out, I'm becoming popular again because I'm not an old man with a Facebook <laughs> account. So... <laughs> That's pretty brilliant, actually. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm thinking 10 steps ahead. I'm playing the long game here. <laughs> For those that don't know, this is the show where either one of us will take turns bringing in a game, surprising the other. They don't know what we're bringing in. And uh, yeah, we're going to play it for your amusement, your enjoyment, and uh, we will likely not do great, but we will review it and hopefully entertain you while we do it. We are gladiators competing for your amusement. Yes. Absolutely. Today is my turn. My turn, Chris. Ah, yes. Yes. See, I brought more serious games this time. I switched it up. What? I switched it up. Um, now I have to bring something crazy. I, I didn't bring anything with balloons or, or whipped cream. But what I did bring, Chris... That was pretty funny. What I did bring is, what's that smell? <laughs> now, what's that smell? It's a party game that stinks, according to the box. It's two to six players. <gasps> yes, I brought one we can actually play. Delicate noses, beware. Yes, yes, it comes with 50 <laughs> scratch and sniff cards that can include whip of shame, whip of... Uh, they still make those? Diaper blowout, oh. extra old toe cheese, smothered in B.O., Hot chunky vomit. Um, uh, well, I'm not going to smell the vomit one because it'll make me throw up. So we'll avoid that card. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see, you should have came on an empty stomach today, Chris. <laughs> you're, you're, you're. So what's that smell? Yeah. This Delicate game, this is game, I'm trying to find. Player discretion is I'm trying to find who makes this game. There is. They are so ashamed of it, they didn't put their name <laughs> on it. Wowie Canada. Wowie Canada. Made this game in the U.S. except the bags were made in China. <laughs> made in Canada. This except game, the game in the bags. It took the whole world <laughs> to make this game right here. Okay, what's that smell? Let's crack her open. What, what's it telling me on the back here? Let the nostril flaring begin. Start the timer. Pick a mystery whip card and try to guess the scent. And pass it on to the next player and do it all over again until the smell round is over. Best sniffer wins. Includes forty-eight mystery whip cards. Four stink cards. Stink. Four resealable scent barrier bags. Oh, well, thank you, China. Six card holders. One sheet of whip scripts. Whatever that is. A score pad and instructions. Oh, it comes with a score pad. Hopefully it See, comes with a pen because I didn't bring one of them. See, that shows yeah, that the Chinese five. have class. They yes. were like, we got to seal this away. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, rules engagement. I'm going to pop some, pop some pieces. Now, here we go. We got the, the stain cards. Chris, I'm going to take Pot Chunky Vomit, and I'm going to put it off to the side for you. Ah, good, because right? that's a trigger smell. I will throw up on camera oh, if I smell so that. so much smells coming out of this box right now. <laughs> will Smothered and B.O. be okay with you? Yeah, that's the only one I can't stand. What about vomit, so. extra old toe cheese? Extra old toe cheese or really good edible cheese? Last year to release the stain. What about diaper blowout? Do you smell shit without growing up? <laughs> I have two younger cousins, and I have had to change their diapers in the past, a long time ago when they were that small. So okay, we have a scorecard. <laughs> we have we have uh, something in a bag here. All right. Uh, what is this? Is this the hold the players? What are we looking at here? Chris, you want to be player one or player two? All right, I'm going to flatten this out so we can put the stuff back when we're done. Right on. Right on. <laughs> uh, well, you can be player one. Okay. See, there's no argument on who play, gets to be player one in this game. 
<laughs> They've already settled one problem that was big with them. Okay, so we got these, we got a scorecard, we do not have a pen. Can you believe they give you a scorecard without a pencil? And for once, I actually don't have one in my pocket. I usually carry a pencil. Can you believe pen. that the Yahtzee people will give you a pencil, but the what's that smell people won't? <laughs> what do we got over and here? This game's probably a lot more expensive than Yahtzee. Yeah. Yeah, we got huge dry erase markers. That'll work. We'll make it work. Oh, okay. So that'll work. I'm gonna. I'm, gonna I'm going to. I uh, get one. I plan to let you smell first and then uh, resign the game. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Got that. The rules of engagement. You ready? Let's hear this. Number one: gather two to six friends. Hey, that are brave enough to play. Well, of course, you had no choice in it today. <laughs> Can our friendship withstand playing this game? Wait and find out. <laughs> brave enough to play and elect a stink pin who will act as a master of ceremony throughout the game. What? So how is this a two to six game if you need if you need master of ceremony in two players? Throughout the game, tally the scores at the end. Okay. Each player should have a card holder. A scorecard and a whiff strip. A whiff strip. I don't know what that little thing is. Oh, or maybe it's one of these scratchers. Wow. Okay. So do we just? Oh, we just pick at random then. Yeah, you just pick at random. So it's a Russian roulette style. Uh. <laughs> That's right. You won't really know the smell until you hit her up. Ask okay. Inside. Do not open. All right. So that. No cheating, you stinker. That's actually, <laughs> that's actually that's how it's spelled. No cheating, you, you stinker. <laughs> Each player should have that. Okay, we got that. Um, you can play with or without the What's That Smell app. What? There's an yeah. app? If using the app, the stink pin selects the gameplay mode, the number of mystery whip cards in play, and a sniffing time of 30, 45, or 60 seconds. Hold your noses. Stir you gotta smell it for like 60 seconds solid? <laughs> Start the timer and pick up your card holder. You release the scent on your card, brush once with your whip strip, and then give it a good sniff. Alright, so... We each get to pick one of these, so I'm going to pick the pie and the pie. And I will take the shoe. I'm not smelling the cat's butt. <laughs> it's got a little X for a butthole. That's great. Okay, each card holder has a smell number. Write it down. Okay. According to this, you have to stare into each other's eyes as you're smelling it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> a smell. <laughs> Write down, then jot down your best smell guess and check off the smelling category that you think it belongs to. So, smell guess, we'll guess what it smells like, and then it belongs to the tutti frutti, the sweet stuff, the spice it up, the blooming fresh, the smoke factor, all things chemical, just plain stinky. All right? All right. Um, when the timer goes off, pass the card holder to the player on the left. The app timer will reset to zero for the new round. The game is done when all the players have smelled all of the cards. These instructions kind of suck, to be honest with you. Hmm. Yeah. Well, of hmm. how many cards are we supposed to pick? Like, you actually have to download the app now to find out. Right? <laughs> right? Well, I mean, I might as well just download the app. Chris, you want to keep reading the instructions from this point on while I look for the app? All right. The stinking, oh, the stink pin gathers all of the facts. <laughs> all of the cards and reveals the answers. Players count their points as follows. The smell guess. You get five points if you guess the top answer and three points for the second and third answer. What, they mixed a bunch of them? <laughs> you get one point if you choose the correct category, even if your smell is guess is wrong. You group votes on whose smell memory is the funniest, and that player gets two points. The next app. There are additional popular answers for each card, so they got kind of one of those prices right style things going that's based on popular opinion. Just run down the street, hey buddy, smell this, what do you think? Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, oh my god, we'll write that down. <laughs> Show me, oh my god! 
Oh, come on, do a Price is Right style board in the app. It's got to do it. You want to play party mode or smell off mode? I think smell off mode because there's only two of us. Yeah, it doesn't really match if you got a party right. mode. Yeah, you're only in. And I'm not playing two players in this game, man. <laughs> you must you read this. This is the app. It's free. Found it on the app store. Just search What's That Smell. Okay. I heard it. What's the Reek Cam? You can probably photograph everybody and then post it online. Smell like the access your marketing. Yeah, it records and takes a photo of you going, oh my god! Alright, we need a sticker. Next. Oh, that's it. Yeah, whatever. Alright. So then you can get a picture of someone going, oh my god! <laughs> you're smelling it. Okay, small off mode, 15 seconds. Pick one mystery card. You each have 15 seconds to guess the smell. Alright. Oh, this is a mystery card. We'll go. We'll oh, that's got a time run. Yeah, I got a time run. You can wear your watch. Um, so okay. But this one says we need to read this before we uh, first, and of course they put it on the back of the book. All right. Uh, storing and carrying for the cards. Your cards come sealed with glue tack. Remove carefully, carefully, and dispose of the glue. To release the scent, gently brush once or twice across the smell zone using whip swift glider. This is not a lottery ticket. The way you use your cards will determine how long they last. Be sure to pass this intel on your friends when they play. <laughs> well, there's nothing that says you're going to get cancer from sniffing. That's got to be the worst possible lottery anybody has ever played with. That is. <laughs> uh, storing your cards must be properly folded so the smell zone is in the inside and then return to the compartment. Otherwise, your fart card may end up smelling like roses. Mm. So you mean it'll decay and smell better now? <laughs> okay, so we're going we're gonna to start with this card. We're going to smell off. Uh, each of the uh, four infamous stink cards or stank cards comes in a flow wrap package. Once opened, carefully transfer the four cards to the four scent barrier bags provided. Make sure these are tightly sealed at all times, except during the whip of shame. So I guess you when you okay. lose it, you so when you <laughs> lose, you get the smell. Yeah, you don't want your box stinking like hot chunky vomit, do you? No, it's probably not a good thing. Ah, all right. Chris, I bought this game in, so I'll Far be it for us to judge. <laughs> so maybe you do want it to reek. I'm definitely allergic to bananas, so hopefully there's no banana card. Oh, that's something we should have checked then. There's really no way to check. So maybe I should smell first in case that does happen. Okay, okay, all right. So you, you kick it off. You'll go first every round. Of all the ways to avoid being the first. Chris, you have 15 seconds to guess this smell. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. So I'm just going to give that a scratch. All right, and go. Ready, steady, it's dummy time. All right, some sort of berry. So we'll say 2D fruity. What's the smell? Some sort of strawberry smell mixed with with uh, erasers. It smells like those old scented erasers. <laughs> strawberry smell mixed with erasers. Yeah, it actually smells like those old erasers. Right. Okay. But I don't think that one's... Uh, banana, so you're probably all right. Dude, it's not a scratch. Ready, steady, yes. In the meantime. Now, he kind of has a cheat, because if he keels over, then it's banana and he knows. So. Yeah. <laughs> Smells like pineapple to me. Pineapple? Maybe I didn't scratch it enough. I want pineapple. Time's up. All right. Who knows best? First player who guesses the top answer wins. Repeat if necessary until we know they all agree to first player. Okay. So, can we just look at the card then? We just, I guess we just look at the card. Yeah, let's have a look at what's yeah. inside. What we got? Pineapple. Pineapple. Pina colada. So that get, was, okay, that's so you, the smell. You get five points of pina, uh, pineapple, three with pina colada, one with tutti frutti. I get you, one you get sad fruity. You get tutti frutti. Okay, let's use that really fat marker and try to. Try to like, what was this? <laughs> Okay, so um, I got I got the I got this one. Oh, wow. I don't know, I'll just dot it. I guess I got five points on that. I didn't guess the smell category. That's right. You're supposed to you're supposed to get the other two. Yeah. Do I get an extra point for having the 
racers uh, <laughs> smell. That's a funny memory. Take it. I don't care. Perfect. If you win, I win. That's it. one step away from it's smelling better. the raunchy yeah, smell. Let's, let's go to your car now. All right. All right. Here you go. Okay. So we're done. I can't identify this one, so um, I don't understand your concept. Okay, you ready? Here we go. Player one, ready, steady. I know this. It's sniffing time. So it took me about ten seconds, but yeah. it's blooming fresh, and it's I think it's roses. Roses? It's some sort of flower like that, yeah. What's your What's your funny Your funny memory from this? I don't have one, so <laughs> so I guess I won't take those points. But uh, hey, you're already you're already putting it in there. You don't you know what the Oh, I know it's blooming fresh. <laughs> Yeah, I'm confident. I guess nah, well, Brent, I was supposed to reveal the answers, but whatever. It's not, whatever. It's not really a game. I'm two. Yeah. There's only two of these, anyway. Some sort of flower, though. I think uh, it's definitely blooming fresh. And I think you kind of nailed it with the roses, too. That's a flower, for sure. Yeah. Time's up. Ooh, we get icky goes. Uh, all right, ready? Mothballs! High air fraction, all things chemical. <laughs> we had <Ooh>. zero points. <laughs> so, it's pretty weird. You can tell I don't get flowers very often, but I think they smell like mothballs. <laughs> okay, well, good smelling mothballs, I guess. It does smell like a flower, though. It's kind of weird. Tell me your points. So, we got no points. <laughs> One step closer to the whiff of shame. Understand this. Like, there's no way you will lose your current progress. If I guess there's no way to continue. So, it. so are we going to do the whiff of shame? Let's just go. Let, let, I don't know. Want to just go to like? I'm not. Want to just fill the car? I, I straight up. I straight up don't think we're getting any cups of whiff of shame. All right. Then. Are you right? I don't really want to smell diaper blowouts. Neither do I. But uh, <laughs> if you were like, no, we have to do it. I'll, I'll do it. We'll just do. Let's just do. I don't know. Five rounds. Six rounds. Whoever's got the most points. Yeah, we can finish the part. Okay, so right now I got five, you got three, right? You got two and one. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so. Okay. Right. Oh, yeah. Ready, steady, it's sniffing time. Come on. <laughs> Take an extra five seconds. Not a lot of tickets, dude. <laughs> Time's up. Maybe spice it up. It smells like something I've smelled before, but I can't place the smell. Really? Yeah. Okay. Layer two. Ready, steady, it's sniffing time. Oh. Yeah, that's a spice. Definitely a spice. Uh, potpourri, maybe? Mm. Some sort of curry, maybe. Yeah, that's a pretty gross one. I'm not going to smell anymore. Okay, so <laughs> it's I'm getting worse I'm the going, more I smell it. <laughs> okay, I'm going to uh, spice it up with potpourri. I said curry, but it's pizza. pizza. Oh, it's the, the herbs. herbs. Yeah. Well, 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 that's got, not, I got the, you got the point for spice it up. Yeah. That's not actually pizza, though. That's not pizza. It's it all like depends the, what kind of topping you get on your pizza. Yeah, or it's the herbs that you put underneath and you never smell anyways because they're covered with everything okay, else on so, the pizza. So we got one. This isn't one. taste it up, it's smell it. <laughs> what's well, that smell, not what's that taste? I'm going to be honest, this is uh, this is probably a game I'm not going to end up keeping after this episode. No. It's, it's got nothing to do with the quality, it's just that it's disgusting. Why? Yeah, even the good scents are like, these aren't really... I love pizza. I ate pizza last night. I sniffed I that pizza. pizza. Last night too, did you? Yeah. My pizza did not smell like that. No. Like, that might be the like the pizza spice you add to the sauce. Potpourri? Like I don't think I would eat pizza that smells like potpourri. So definitely not. Ready? Right. Right. Here we go. Here we go. Ready, steady. It's 
It's chemical. It's chemical? Yeah. And I know reeky chemicals. Time's up. Some sort of shoe smell. It almost smells like new shoe. New shoe. Yeah, like that rubbery smell. New shoe. Player two. Ready, steady, yes. Time's up. Yeah, it's got that rubbery smell to it. Chemical. Time's up. Boots. Boots? Like rubber boots. Yeah. Or rain. Yeah, like the brushes kind of. Yeah. Yeah. You ready? <laughs> Lemons? I guess if it's really weak, it could be lemon peel smell. I guess. But yeah, we failed pretty badly on that one. <laughs> I kind of feel like the more you do, the more your senses are all fucked up. And then you're like, oh, lemons yeah. smell like rubber boots. <laughs> Yeah, this isn't really a, a game you would play over a very long period. It's, no. Uh, <laughs> well, we got six spots on this card, so we'll just we'll do six rounds, okay? So that was round four. Nibble on me. Rinse my nostrils out. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. That's, that's, that'll, that'll clear it out for me. <laughs> All right. Oh, man. And it back to the main menu. Brush. I can already smell it from here. Really? You haven't brushed it yet? <laughs> Ready, steady, yes, in the meantime. Oh, it's, um, um, it's that mint stuff. It smells like that mint stuff the dentists use for the, the teeth. But the fluoride? The fluoride. Really? It smells like mint fluoride. I actually like, I actually like the smell of fluoride, so we'll, we'll see. Player two. What fluoride Ready, would fall under what? Steady. I don't know. Chemical, maybe? Time. I probably tutti fruity just because the smell itself. Oh yeah, hey, that's a fluoride smell yeah. right there. But not the mint one, like that pink stuff they gave you. Oh yeah, yeah. Tutti fruity, tutti fruity, dentist fluoride. All right, here we go. Grapes, grapes. fruit punch, tutti fruity. Well, I don't know if that's grape, but all right. Uh, I mean. Are we like it's, it's grape? It's a grape smell. It is. Yeah, I think we're just thinking too high on it. Oh yeah, kind of like that grape getting powder. High. You know those kids uh, <laughs> <laughs> get high off it. You remember those thing, the lick stick ones, where you oh, like yeah, the, the candy the, stick and the grape. That's the actually fun, what fun that smells like. Right? Right? I'm thinking of it. All right. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm gonna pick. Up. At least we got tutti frutti correct. I'm picking up my old card here. The okay. final card. The final card. All right. Oh, I'll use the opposite side. Stop my nose. I should have probably ended with this game. I mean, yes, in the meantime. Right. Oh, 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 it's a bad one. <laughs> oh, that's a chemical smell. <laughs> you're just you're like going cross eyed. Yeah. This had better not wind up being a good food like the other ones because it's disgusting. <laughs> it's like a chemical smell. <laughs> yeah. Vega, one month old McDonald's food. Yeah. Ready, I can really smell it. Steady, yes. Oh. <laughs> oh, what is... oh. You should have took my word for it. <laughs> I, I don't know. It's just like <laughs> <laughs> the way you make up a sniff. Oh, it hurts. Oh man, I actually felt my eyes turn to water. Oh, quick, cancel it out with the, the grape. <laughs> the grape oh, the floor that was good. That was good. <laughs> oh, but I still got. To, I still need to kind of guess what this is. I can't even do it. It's got. I'll put it. I'll put it's, on, it's chemical. Just plain stinky. It's going under that. Oh yeah, I guess I need the answer. Ready? I know what it is. Crayons. crayons. How does crayons, crayons fall under smoke factor? I guess if you light them on fire, they smell like that. <laughs> I've never lit a crayon. Really? Well, I was 
well, smoke factor. I would say I would say chemical. Now I'm thinking about the smell of crayons. Yeah, I guess a little bit, but oh. yeah, I don't think that's. And what's the other one? Copper wood. You could say copper or wood, and it falls under smoke. If factor. that's your idea of what wood smells like, you've got a serious problem. Or copper too, actually. Copper definitely doesn't smell like that. Oh wow! I really uh. See, you were so smart. You're like starting far and then you leave it in. I just like, man. And now my eyes are watering. Oh. This makes me think of those cartoons where they play the song the sound. Yeah. Ooh, the bad smell. All right. We're going to turn off the app here. We're going to turn off the app. We're going to go up the camera so we can kind of get a better look at the fantasticness of this. This is your scorecard. But the smell gas, the smell category, the smell These association. Reach so bad you can almost smell it through the plastic. I could kind of smell it when, when I opened it. Maybe we should throw these in the sealed plastic things. Yeah. Like the instant. Uh, <laughs> yeah. There's a part that you smell, and then you open it up, and you reveal the answer. Apparently, the last one was crayons, which definitely was not crayons. We get five points for crayons, yeah. Yeah, I have fond memories of the smell of crayon. That was not the smell of crayon. Yeah, I, I mean, I smelt the crayons. I smelt the crayons. This is uh, extra old toad cheese. Oh, yeah, you can smell that right through the plastic. Chris, what do you got? You got the diaper bowl. <laughs> <laughs> you can smell it kind of oh, through the paper. Man. Oh, man. Luckily, it doesn't quite smell like diaper blowout, so hopefully they didn't... Oh. Uh, this game, this game by Wowee, is absolutely confusing. Yep, yep. We need a pit, so we can be like fit for the pit. Then we get sued, of course. Fit for uh, the pit. Oh. If this were on Street Sense, it would be fit for the pit, and then the pit would refuse to take it. Okay. <laughs> Chris, yeah. I'll review this right now by saying that the ages on this is 14 plus, which is ridiculous, because I think only kids would enjoy this game. Oh, yeah. As an adult in my thirties, um, I uh, I mean it, it's fun. It, it's fun. That's actually much better than those cards was. Oh, oh, it, yeah, it's not art odor. artificial friggin' weird smells from other countries. Oh, I've um, I've smelt bad smells. Uh, I once worked in a paper mill right next to the machine that makes that nice paper mill smell. Yes. And I've been in there for entire days, like sixteen yeah. hour days, mm -hmm. and that was actually better than this. That's just all bad. This is just raunchy. Like, even the ones that should smell good don't smell that good. Uh, Scratch and sniff technologies have definitely uh, fallen downhill since yeah. the old days when they made them. Uh, I, was, I remember those cards used to work. <laughs> yeah, they would work well. Like, you could smell those things for days. I'm definitely putting these in the good place. Oh, yeah. Okay, so straight up. <laughs> these are like vacuum sealed bags. Yeah. Uh, like the sides are double extra thick, melted together, sealed bags. Like, <laughs> if an astronaut punctured his spacesuit, they could repair it with this kind of thickness bags. <laughs> oh, yeah. You know what? If you have allergies, stay away from this game. One hundred percent. This game will kill you. If you don't have allergies, stay away from this game. <laughs> yes. If you I'm, don't have allergies, I'm really glad you were not insisting on smelling these whiff cards. I'm really happy that I bought this during a going out of business clearance sale for like three dollars. <laughs> so if I would have paid any type of full price, I would have been horribly disappointed. Oh, yeah. I don't even think I'm gonna give this. Like I usually give the the funny kitty type games to my niece. Uh. She would wonder why you hated her if she gave her this. Uh, why don't you love me anymore? I won't even do that. I won't even do that. This is going right to some poor sucker at the second-hand well, store. Especially this. Uh, anybody who would put that on a smell card is just cruel. Yeah, you can't just call it vomit. No, it's got to be hot, chunky vomit. Well, that and most people, when they smell vomit, they throw up. And they say it's a reaction, reflex. Yeah, I'm one of those people. So yeah, <laughs> I would have made for a pretty entertaining episode. Of that. Just you projectile vomiting across it's the like, table. Uh, <laughs> and Chris is off the show forever, and our second episode coming back. <laughs> that was a really short-lived season. <laughs> and then I would become that guy who threw up on the internet. <laughs> uh.
but then again, when everybody made fun of me on social media, I wouldn't actually see it. So it you wouldn't see, me. yeah, you wouldn't so, see any uh, of it. You'd be totally just. I'm kind of immune from blue. that, uh, from getting ashamed like that, because I would never be able to see it. Yep. <laughs> see, it's not so bad. Not so bad at all. Um. Yeah. What's that smell? I don't recommend it, Chris. I definitely don't recommend it either. Nope. It looks like they were trying to be kind of gamey and funny, which maybe it could have been, but they they really kind of missed badly on those scents. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's garbage pile over there. Let's throw that in here. Um, yeah, don't buy this game whether you see it on clearance or not. This definitely smells better than those cards did. Yeah, that, that marker. And I think I've killed the smell of those cards. So thank you, uh, Expo Dry Erase, lower you low over <laughs> markers. <laughs> thank you, Expo Dry Erase. This conforms to Aston D4, D236. If you are going to play this game, make sure you have an Expo Dry Erase marker <laughs> with you at the table. Low odor, but great to sniff in. And you notice, know, like all awesome. good products, they don't tell you if this is not toxic or not. Yeah. So. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't even care if it was or not. Highly toxic, whatever. I gotta get this out of my nose right now. All right, everybody, that's been the second episode of Board Off. The, this is awful. This is just straight up awful. Chris, I think so far you are winning at bringing the games to this table. Uh, definitely, that 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 other game did beat this one. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get it? Oh, you got that apple crumble over there. I'm going to shove some of that up my nose. <laughs> so uh, tune in for the outtakes where Ken shoves an apple crumble up his nose. Yeah. Yeah, no, this is going to happen. I think I've been tortured enough with this right here. Oh, you can find us on all the social media sites that you won't find Chris on. Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Our other shows are also available through Apple Podcasts and SoundCloud, but this one right here, Board Off, is exclusive to YouTube. So right now, what you are seeing is what you will see right here. I'm Ken. That's Chris. We're going to go cry in the corner now. <laughs> Catch us next week on Board Off Classic, our old show from four years ago. Crappy audio, crappy quality, but lots of entertainment to be found. It's still better than this game. It's still better than this game. This game belongs in the past. We should have done this four years ago so we could have learned from our mistakes. <laughs> I just created new mistakes today with this. My bad. Sorry, Chris. Ah, it happens. They can't all be, uh, <laughs> they can't all smell like roses. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> or, or pizza. Or pizza. <laughs> Sometimes games wind up being a real stinker. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> we'll see you back here in two weeks with an all new board off. Quick, turn the turn it off before I come up with more puns. <laughs> that does smell better. It does. <laughs>